The experimental settings in the development menu are just that, experimental, and we don't recommend you ever switch these on on a production site. Particularly the first option to enable global search, which can slow your Moodle site down considerably. The debugging setting is very useful for developers, people who are writing and testing code. For most administrators, this isn't necessary unless you have a particular problem. The XML database editor is used for directly editing the database. Again, this is something that as an administrator you would very rarely need to do. Web services is a very new area of Moodle and this test client can help people who know what they're doing to test out functionality. It's something that you probably won't need to do as an administrator right now. Usually, using a cache will help speed up your Moodle site. From time to time, for example if significant development has taken place, you may want to purge the caches so that the browsers are forced to load the most up-to-date information. Unit tests are used by developers to test out new code. The functional database tests again are a developer feature and enable developers to run tests against the underlying database. 